You've probably seen it, heard it, and maybe even felt it over the past few days. All this stormy weather Prince George and region have seen will be sticking around for a little longer. While we're getting drenched, it's a nice break for fire crews who have been busy battling fires across the north. Thunderstorms, rain, and even hail. Prince George has seen it all in the past couple days. While this wet weather is putting a damper on summer plans, at least some are enjoying it. Across the Prince George Fire Center, the fire danger is primarily moderate to low at the moment, but there are still a couple pockets of high danger. Most of the Prince George Fire Center is experiencing a soggy stretch, giving forest firefighters a little reprieve. As we get further into the season, uh, crews may have some time off. I'm sure they're all starting to look forward to it. All this gray weather is expected to stick around for the next few days. We've experienced quite a bit of thunder showers and some rain as well. Um, we had uh, an upper level uh, low pressure system actually uh, come in from the Pacific Ocean and that has brought in some cold air aloft. And with the strong solar radiation we're still experiencing at this time of the year, this has led to quite a bit of instability. So we're having these thunder showers build up in the afternoon and obviously bring us some rain and actually some hail as well in some of these storms. Even though the weather is cooler and wetter, it doesn't mean the coast is clear when it comes to fires, because with rain comes lightning. The fire people may be concerned about the thunder showers, uh, with the lightning uh, sparking some new fires possibly. It's good that we've had quite a bit of rain over the last few days that might mitigate uh, some of the new fires, but uh, hopefully uh, lightning will not be a factor in generating some new fires. Uh, especially if we get a couple days of warm weather with some wind, those will change the fire danger ratings quite quickly. It doesn't take long to dry out, especially the fine fuels. Think about laundry hanging on your line. You get a little bit of a breeze, it doesn't take too long to dry it out, even if it was soaking wet to start with. Meteorologists say the summer weather should return after this rainy patch, and temperatures will stay above average for the rest of summer. As for the fire center, there's no telling when they'll be out of the woods. Everyone's speculating on that, uh, and who knows what September will bring. Last year, September was a fairly busy time for the fire center, and it may be again. Historically, things have tended to taper off towards the end of August, but that seems to be changing, so who knows. Kelly Lanahan, CKPG News.